So we're here in the new Lincoln Navigator, and I just want to say thank you so much, Lincoln, for giving us this opportunity. This is a gorgeous car. Now, so let's get right into this interior over here. So I want to start here with the gear selector. This is one of the most different, but also one of the most ingenious gear selectors that I've ever seen. We've got little levers here, so you can push and you go into reverse, you can push and go into neutral, drive, and park also. So that's really cool. It look, looks really clean rather than like having a big kind of lever over here. Also, it's got lots of storage space right here in the center. So you can just push over here and we've got our two USB ports, also upside down USB. I'm not sure uh, why, but we also have a power mount over here. So for wireless charging, you know, 21st century, all these phones have wireless charging now. You know, plug anything in, it's super convenient. Now also on this side, we've got cup holders and a little storage cubby for you to put some stuff, um, possibly your key because this does have remote start stop. And this is what I found most interesting. Over here, we can open this up and this has the most space I've ever seen in any sort of a, a vehicle. So here, I'll stick my hand in. It goes so low. It's like almost my whole forearm. That's how deep it is. You can like stick easily all the camera gear, anything you want, you can stick it right in here. Now, uh, also we have this gigantic steering wheel with all this stuff over here. It looks really premium. Now, we know that Lincoln, it's a luxury car brand. So we've got leather everywhere. And we've got these gigantic visors, you know, just kind of luxury. You can block out the block out the sun while you're driving. It's very a luxurious experience. And also we do have a heads up display over here. It's got our speedometer. It's got the gas, uh, how much range we have left, temperature and time. So that's really useful. I always loved heads up displays because it's kind of bad to like look down here at your speedo uh, while you're trying to drive. And also talking about the speedo, it's a full electronic dash over here. Uh, which gives us access to everything and which makes it fully customizable, which is really nice. I love how these new modern cars are doing this. And then here in the center, we have this gigantic touchscreen. It's very responsive. You know, the pinch to zoom, it works really smoothly. Um, it's one of the better displays that I've seen in vehicles today. And okay, so over here, we've got handles, just kind of a comfort kind of thing. And now let's talk about the rear. So in the rear, we have, let's see, three, five, seven seats total in this vehicle and in the center seat for the third uh, second row we have this beautiful center console with uh, cup holders and charging ports and it really gives you everything because this is a luxury car so you want to have luxury throughout the cabin now also in the interior we have a gorgeous sound system so we have our big speaker here we've got speakers on the pillars uh, over here and over here and i'm sure this is probably one of the highest quality sound systems that i've ever seen uh, we also have the remote start stop as i mentioned and as a driver you get access to everything right here without having to take your hands off the wheel like we have all the heads up display navigation volume all that stuff right here on the steering wheel and over here on the side we have the seat controls we have volume seat heaters uh unlock we have the mirror controls the um and the window controls and then in the center console it's a very simple center console with really only your uh, climate controls and your radio because a lot of the stuff is in the touchscreen which gives it a very clean kind of a look which i'm a big fan of i like i like the buttons to be hidden and uh and that's why i really like this kind of a look with everything hidden it's just very clean um also up here we have our uh little mirror if you want to look back into your cabin you also have your place to keep your sunglasses this was really convenient i actually had this in my odyssey and this was probably one of the best features I've ever had because it's so convenient to be able to just keep your sunglasses there while you're driving. You can just easily grab them. And uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, this Lincoln, it's going to be coming out by the end of 20, uh, 2017 and January of 2018. And uh, it starts at 72,000 and it'll range up to about 100,000 when you get the premiere package. And this is right under the premiere, but I can't imagine.